Testing, testing. How's the audio sound? It's been a while since I've done this. Everyone here that wants to be here. Okay, cool. Well, with that, um, let me see. There, just gotta turn down the volume a little bit so I can hear myself talk. Um, let's see. Also, get the stream pulled up on my phone so I can keep along with the chat. Too many titles. Kromnik student, you should know by now. You give me too many titles. Most of which aren't deserved. Maybe a few are, but whatever. Let's see. So, if I recall correctly, the last time I played this was... What was it, like, two weeks ago on a Saturday? And apparently since then there's been an update to the game, so um, there is a chance that if I load the save it's going to break it. Okay, let's try this. Let's see if the update breaks the game. I would be genuinely surprised if it doesn't. The game might just crash anyways, so we'll see. Oh, ha ha ha, it's a cool loading screen, you say. Yeah, it is pretty cold. Pretty cool indeed. It's also pretty slow. Hurry up already. I want to see if the game works. Nah, you're not too late. I actually just started this literally a few seconds ago, so we're good. Hello there! Hey! How you doing? Okay, I'll, I'll take hints. As long as, like, someone doesn't say, like, Hey, are there, hey there's a secret right there. Like, give me some hints. That, that would be kind of cool. I don't mind hints too much. Just don't spoil anything that comes later, you know? Like, I have a feeling that General Brand is going to be the final boss, but I don't want people to spoil that for me, you know? Like, it could be something different. You already spoiled something, I get a tank? Asshole. <laughs> I want this to be as pure of a... Hmm. I knew I should have just disabled comments. I, I should have just, like, disabled comments. Shut up. Don't tell me about the secrets. Don't tell me about the tank. Don't tell me about anything. Bitch ass. Don't tell me anything. He did! He said it twice! Kromik student, I like you, but don't you dare. <laughs> Keep everything to yourself until I get into the game. You have sinned! I shall give you the taste of my shoe. <laughs> e namaste. 
Hey, how are you doing? This loading screen... How long have we... I, I think this loading screen is the game. What, what's it even doing? Let me, let me check. Let's see, I'm just going to open up the console and see if anything happens. I don't know if it crashed because it's still it still has a moving background so I don't and I'm clicking and it's not like eh I don't know I don't like this are we good? are you gonna load the rest of the way? anytime soon? Yeah, um, let me do that actually, I'm gonna just quit the game and then try it from scratch. I kind of had a feeling that the latest patch might have broken the game. So, we'll see. Let's see, um... What did exit the game as much as it did cause it to crash? Fantastic. It is Crow Team 2.0. Okay. So, I command you to close. 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 How can we start closing? Okay, control alt delete. Let's see. What's going on over here? Serious Sam. End. Away with you. Okay, and then we start the game back up, and then we try loading that save again. If it doesn't work this time, then I'll basically just go and, like, create a new save game, I guess. Like, we'll start the level from scratch. I really don't want to restart the level from scratch, because that means that I'll probably lose all my skill points and all my progress. Okay, and let's keep this thing open, just to see if it's actually going to do stuff as we play through this. Ah, thank you. Hello and have a good stream. Hope you're having a good time watching the loading screen because that's pretty much what this game is. It's Serious Sam Loading Screen Edition. I mean, Serious Sam 4 has long ass load times, but at least it's consistent. This, on the other hand. This one, on the other hand, like, it just. Sometimes we'll like crash during the loading screen and you won't know it. Let's see, what do we have here? Oh, wait a second. Ah, fuck. Did I? Hold on. Uh, where's the next level? Hello? What? Didn't we beat this one already? Let's see, Stormbrainer, that's level two. Huh. Did it not save for some reason? Oh, you're shitting me. We have to do this level again? Hold on. Wait, I'm... Give me one second. That's... That can't be. Okay, single player. Siberian Mayhem. Roadside Picnic. Okay, so it actually does register that I've beat the level. Um... Well, shit, if we do this, we're gonna lose, like, all of our skill points. And that's not good. Damn. Um... Hmm... 
What do I do? You know what? Let's try it. Let's see if this will work. I actually have half a mind just to replay the previous level and get the skill points. That way I have like an advantage at least because I don't know how many I'm going to be given in this level. Maybe use the console, give yourself some skill points? Nah, that'd be cheating. And I don't cheat. Not unless something breaks. But even then, I don't like doing it. I like to find ways around it. Okay, I like that sound. What was it gonna do now? Okay, let's see how this goes. Two things are unrelated. <laughs> okay. Oh, wait a second. It actually saved all my skill points and progress up to this point. Interesting. Okay. Okay, um, let's check around really quick. Let's see, what do we have? What? 16 secrets. Okay, at least it's not as bad as the previous level, but 16 is still 16. That's a lot. Let's see, so usually in Serious Sam games, you want to put a secret under your starting point, or somewhere near it, so... Let's see... Yep, okay, I see something. Seagulls! Die. 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 Okay. Hoverboard scooter. Cool. Nothing underwater. Okay. Nothing here. Wreckage of a boat. Let's see. Anything this way, I wonder. Nope. Okay. You think the hoverboard's one of the more fun gadgets? You know, I haven't actually used either of the new gadgets. Let's see, so here's the hoverboard. And this is the airstrike. Obviously the airstrike, I know what it does. It calls them like... Well, it's not even an airstrike, it's a mortar thing. But this, I haven't actually used. I read the description of it though and it sounds pretty neat. Let's see, boxcar... Okay, let's grab some of this stuff. Crossbow bolts. Yes, please. Ammo. Yes. I see something over here. Just an abandoned car. And I can't jump over this pile of rubble. Okay. Why would you make it look like you can jump up here if you can't? What about up here? Can I go up here? Somehow? No? Okay. Slippery wall syndrome. I don't know if the game's running better or not. Because I know that they did like a performance patch to it. Does it look smooth to you guys? I don't know. That's... Kind of subjective. I don't know if it's actually smoother looking or not. This looks like a big fight area. Let's see, crossbow bolts, shotgun shells, yes please. A big hill with a church on top of it. Okay. And also there's this. This looks pretty interesting.
Okay, what do we get? Uh, hello? Okay. Oh, it spawns some stuff. Okay. Rockets. Nice to have. This looks good. Is that it? It didn't drop anything else. Okay. Well, I guess that wasn't too bad. Unless something spawns over here. Okay, I'm guessing this is going to be the big fight. Let's see what happens. The combat music from the trailer kicks in. And kamikazes, look at that. That is quite a few kamikazes. Luckily the Biomex are kind of helping out though, they're just like shooting rockets and the splash damage is killing them off. That is a lot, okay. You know what? Yo, help me out with this. Oh shit, okay, that is quite a bit. That wasn't too bad. That wasn't bad at all. Okay. Yeah, let's go. I think I could have used like one of those artillery strikes on it. Maybe next time. I don't know. That was fun though. I like that fight. Oh yeah, that's kind of like the, the tower area that we came from. You can even see it destroyed. That's cool. Can we go into town? Oh, there is something here. Let's see. Life gadget. Cool. Okay, looks like we got another one of those guard tower enemies over there. Um, let's see, a shed. Okay, I see something glowing over there. Hello! Opportunity for puns. Then again, it's easy to go off track with those. 
Oh my god. Badass! Sam I am. Hell yeah. <laughs> nice. Oh, it's even got the... Si Do you know how long I've wanted to see a tank in Serious Sam? I actually had, like, a mission planned out where you would get a tank for, like, a Serious Sam rework thing, and now there's actually a drivable one here. Oh, hello. Dude, that's so fucking cool. Okay, let's see how it handles. Cannon, machine gun, space for boost. Oh, that is some weird handling. Okay, let me get used to that. Uh, did I already get stuck? God, I'm the best at driving. Ooh. Hello, beautiful. <laughs> yes! <laughs> Burn! <laughs> Dude. <laughs> yes. <laughs> this is even better than I imagined. Okay. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> oh my god, that's so good. Oh, I missed. Okay, let's see. Hit. Yeah, there we go. Boom. Get out of here. Come on, die already. Yeah! <laughs> yes! Dude, this is brilliant. Okay, whoever came up with this is my new favorite person. This shit is delicious.
kind of sad that there isn't like a first person mode on it, but whatever. This is good. I probably would have used third person anyways. How'd the tire die how'd the tower die without hitting the core? I'm just that good apparently. Oh, I know what you are. Here's a still. Oh yeah, I forgot it has boost. That's even better. <laughs> okay, I'm loving this. <laughs> this is really good. I am so happy someone made this a thing. Black Spike. I have no words for this, this is just fantastic. Yeah, there you go. Wait, what do you mean heal the tank? Can I do that? How do I heal the tank? He's just a game man. Yo, this game is the game. Bro. You're telling me I can't have fun with it? That's like the entire reason that games are even made, is to have fun with them, and I'm actually having fun. That's something I can't really say about... really... Well, that's not true, I did have fun with Serious M4, but this is just like... straight up just good time, you know? Tank, you have served me well. Thank you. Thank you for everything. I'll never forget our time together, sweetheart. Maybe I'll see you after the war? Give me a call. Hell yeah. Let's do it. <laughs> That's awesome. Cabbage. Okay. Wow, that tank section, though. I still can't get over how good that was. It wasn't really what I was thinking, but I'm glad I got what I got. That was really fun. 
Gonna do some epic par parkour up this. No. Okay. Let's see. Can I even go back here somehow? No. Wait, you can re how do you repair the tank? What? I thought I thought it was just like for the segment you had the tank. I didn't even know you could repair it. What? How do you do that? I'm curious now. Ah, whatever. Guess I'll figure it out next time. Oh, okay. This is a reminder. The demolition of the ancient non-human structure as per directive M1532B is scheduled for later today. Structure. Remember to huh. avoid placing important Sounds resources promising. within the blast radius. The punishment for forgetting to wear your hard hat is death. An exception will be made for headless kamikazes. Fantastic, thank you. Oh, I should have let it play, damn it. Can I drive this? No? Okay. Can I just say how beautiful Siberian Mayhem looks? And it actually runs like 10 times better than. Never mind. I was gonna say it runs 10. It actually does run better than the Sir. Excuse me, Serious M4. For sure and it looks way more beautiful it kind of shows just how like a consistent art style can really make a game stand out there oh don't you dare okay Really, nothing up here, okay. It's not so much that the graphics are improved, it's just that the game has more consistent art style. My biggest problem with Serious Sam 4 is that everything just looked like a big Unity asset rip. This though, like, you know, the vehicles aren't clean, they actually have like texture on them. You know, like, they actually look gritty, they look like they've been in this environment, they look like they belong. In the military stuff, you know, it's like a more modern setting, seeing like actual military stuff. You know, it just makes sense. That that's that's the point I'm trying to make. Like Serious M4 was just like a unity asset flip. This shit though Oh hello, is that is that a crow That is, that's like a really low resolution crow team symbol, I think. But anyways, like this stuff actually looks like it belongs in the environment. And it fits the art style. It, it also doesn't get in the way. Like, if this was a serious Sam 4 map, like, this tractor would just, like, be randomly right here in the middle of where all the action is. Instead, like, everything's, like, nice and pushed off to the side. Uh, let's, you know, the, the gameplay flow like it's supposed to. So the object placement and the way that the objects look in the environment feels natural. That's why I think it looks more beautiful. Not necessarily because... Oh, the graphics are so good. It's it's just like the little things, you know? The little things really do add up. Hi. How are you? I've received your message and the data you attached. It looks like you may have discovered something of great value to the EDF. I'm sending some of my men to retrieve the manuscript. I know an expert in Moscow who may be able to translate the Proto-Slavic. Keep digging, and remember, 
Because of the potential sensitivity of this information, the entire operation has been classified top secret. You are to communicate about your findings with no one except myself. Understood? We'll see about that, Brand. We'll see. Okay, so I guess I need to restore power and then I can activate this. Okay. That's cool. Do I like the Devastator or the Crossbow? I definitely like the Crossbow better. I'm just a huge fan of railguns overall, so this... Obviously, being a railgun, just... I don't know. I, I think it's like the best way that they possibly could have balanced out the Sniper Rifle and the Devastator. Like, instead of having both of them compete for the same role, just get rid of both of them and combine them into one kind of powerful weapon. Yeah, I think you're onto something there. I think Crow Team is dedicating a lot of their resources to Talos 2. When, in reality, no one really asked for Talos 2. They should have dedicated all their resources to Sirius Sam 4, because that's... Sirius Sam is the series that made them who they are. And they're just like, Nah, let's just like give our fans this. Let's take their money and then make Talos 2, because that's what we want to make. I mean, as a developer, I understand like that you want to make something that you want to make, obviously, but... If you're not a big fan of Serious Sam, then just like sell it off to someone who's passionate, you know? Have someone else be in charge of it if you don't want it anymore. Okay, this area is a bit laggy. Oh, hello! Yeah, laggy's an understatement. That's super lag. Okay, there we go. Just hoping Talos 2 is more in six puzzle environments. Yeah. Puzzle games aren't really my thing. I like the original Talos principle. I like the fact that they made it. But, I don't know. Like, the fact that they just kind of more or less, like, abandon the spirit of Sirius Hume. And they're just like, ah, let's just stick with this. Like, that, that, that rubs me the wrong way. This is lag, okay, th yeah, th this is pretty laggy over here. I have these weird lag pause things. There's a room with puzzles in this level. Oh boy. I love puzzles. I hear that. This kind of reminds me of, like, Crisis a little bit. Syrian Starship Fuel. Ooh, okay. Weird glowy crystals, black monolithic structures, protoslavic manuscript. Okay, cool. Lots of stuff. Nice. And another weird pause. Okay, hello spider. Hey, they actually jib when you kill them. That's cool. I wish that they did that all the time.
Might be because this thing does like 13 damage, who knows. Like maybe the increased damage like passes their jibbing threshold or whatever and makes them just die violently. Yeah, this section is a lag fest, for sure. Hi. How are y'all doing? Yeah, I don't like these lag spikes for sure. These, these are pretty bad. Nice secret, though. I kind of like that. It's cool. How many do we have, anyways? We only have 5 out of 16. That's quite a... Alright. Oh, I see. Okay, lag. Don't screw me over here. I'm begging you. This section looks like Marsh Hopper territory. Those Russian architects, man. They sure put things in weird places. Incredible. Oh, it's these annoying ass things. Oh boy, the frog room has made a return. Okay. these signs. Here, let's grab that. Ow. I'm gonna take one of these just to heal up a bit. Okay, there we go. Like Spike, don't you dare. Let's grab some armor. Yeah, there we go. Ow. I hate these things. This is my least favorite enemy in the entire expansion pack. I would have much prefer that they just brought back Marsh Hoppers instead of making these abominations, but oh well. Because they're basically like overpowered clears. And that's saying something. Like, they're technically less tanky than a clear, but their patterns are like really erratic. They have like I think their leap attack actually does even more damage than like a clear would. I don't know, I hate them. They suck. Yeah, there we go. Oh my god, these things are stupid. Die! Hate you. Go away. Don't come back. I would have much preferred to fight a bunch of clear here instead of those stupid things. What are you talking about, though? The Oasis fight's really fun and a lot easier than this. By a long shot. Well, maybe not easier, but it is more fun. These things are just like pure rage. They make me so angry every time they, every time I see them because they're just like so obnoxious. Main problem is they just they just do like way too much damage for like the charging attack. I don't even think they should have a charging attack. I think they should purely just hang back and throw projectiles while other rushing enemies well, rush you, you know? There would be like little distractions in the background that Oh no, they actually do jib, even from like a regular pistol bullet. Okay. 
Ah, forget it. I've already rambled on enough about how much I hate that enemy. No, no reward for the fight. It was just something that you had to do to in order to progress. Oh yeah, is this the fight? I knew you were behind me. I actually like that fight. That one's cool. The new rocket explosion effect. Hmm. Yeah, it could be a bit more flashy. I think it's better than the one in Serious Sam 4, though. The, the one in Serious Sam 4 is basically like a big flashbang, like where you can't even see what you're hitting after it explodes. Yeah, it's decent, not groundbreaking. They've definitely made better explosions in the past, but eh, whatever. Okay, now they're gonna give us a bunch of shit. You know, I should have collected the armor first before grabbing the super armor. Damn it. Okay. We're doing this. Let's see what happens. Oh, I do have the multi rockets. I didn't even realize. Lag spike, stop it. Oh, not you, things. You're the last thing I wanted to see right now. Like spikes, man. Are you charge me again? Or don't, that's fine. too bad. I actually like that fight a lot, just not the Super Marsh Hopper things. Still hate those. Oh yeah, let's listen to this, see what Brand has to say. Oh, and they grow up. This is just a bunch of rocks. 
Well, who's talking now, huh? They refused to bring me those crystallized black holes, but I found a way to get them. The portal works. I was on the other side. Looks like it's still somewhere north, probably Antarctica or something. One throwback. You have to install the crystals on both sides, or the portal will only work for a short time before it throws you back to the cave. Man, those minions found the bunker today. I'm out of time. Luckily, I prepared for this. Wait. What was that sound? Okay, um, let's see. Grab the stuff. Get the rocket launcher ready. Oh, another one. Not an armor shard, never mind. Okay. I missed a secret. Um, let's see. Can I go back and grab it, or did I already pass it? There is this little thing. Oh, yeah. Haha, <laughs> there it is. Cool. Thank you for pointing that out. Oh yeah, let's take a look at this stuff. So we got these things, these guys, da da da. Sirius Sam. Hey, that's me. In Egypt. Killing a bunch of clears. Nice. I'm the best. And then we got the thing here and that. Oh, auto shotgun secret. I didn't know about that. Yeah, let me... I want to see if I can get it. Let's see, I'm going to try to jump back here. Maybe there's like a secret switch I can press. I'll open up that door. That's my guess. Speaking of auto shotgun, I think the auto shotgun would have been really useful for the elevator encounter. Just saying. Like, auto shotgun here would have been really helpful. Or hell, even a flamethrower. Like, if they managed to bring the flamethrower back somehow, that'd be cool. Don't think it's goable now. Ah, okay. I'll give up on it. Maybe there's a way I can go back for it later. Let's see, message. Oh, I'm not gonna read all that. You guys can if you want, I'm not. Yo, this looks clean, bro. Look at this. Wow. This is pretty impressive looking. Let's see, there is just a random helmet back here. Let's see. Anything up here, maybe? I don't think I'm supposed to go back here. Yeah, something tells me I'm not supposed to be back here. <laughs> okay, over here we go. This? This is pretty cool looking. For sure. Alright, through the portal I go. Uh, hi.
Yeah, don't do that. Okay. Yeah, no. Okay. How does... Okay. Oh, okay, he's right there. Hold on. Grab that stuff, grab this. Black spike. Where is he? Ah, oh, there he is. Yo, I actually like these things. Oh. Okay. That's a new attack. Nice. Not bad at all. Yeah, good music. <laughs> cool. And that is a giant Syrian door. I haven't seen these things since BFE. Wow. Okay. Throwback. And what do we get here? We get a black hole crystal. Two of them. Not bad at all. Ah ha the stupid little bimp, little lag spike thing that happens is the worst. You know what? So I can either go up or I can go down, I think. Here, go up. Nah, there's just a floor under it. Never mind. These lag spikes, though. Is it up? Already okay. Come on. Come on. Give me the elevator. There we go. Is it coming back down? Hope so. Oh, I think I hear it. Yeah, there it is. Come back down. Thank you. Actually, before I go in there, uh, let me try something. Can I jump up here, maybe, somehow? Perhaps? I want to get up here. Oh, wait, I think I found the spot. Yeah, there we go. Nothing. Wow. Okay. How about if we go back here? I wonder if, like, the door unlocked or... 
Nah, it's still locked. Well, okay. Guess we're gonna take the elevator and leave. See how it goes. See what the rest of the map is like. Press... Lift boy, take me up. Hey, thank you, Andre Pashinetiv. Wait, Pash... Pashnet... I can't say your last name. Pashent... Wait, Pashentsev? Pashentsev. I actually have a feeling that would have been easier to read in Cyrillic since, like, the... There's actually, like, a dedicated, like, TS symbol in Russian. Or Cyrillic. It's like a little U with, like, a little ding thing that sticks off the end of it, like... I, I feel like I would have actually been able to pronounce that a little bit easier if I actually had it in Cyrillic. <laughs> yeah, because normally, like, you see it in Latin alphabet, it's like, eh, that doesn't work, you know, like... Pashentsev. Pashentsev. Yeah, that, that would have been way easier. Well, I guess someone can add that to the compilation list of me horribly mispronouncing someone's name on stream. That seems to be like a recurring theme at this point. By the way, explosive barrel. I'm surprised it didn't blow the door open. Okay, let's leave this area and see what's going on over here. Oh, reptiloid. No problem. Line up. Okay. You ain't nothing. Not bad, not bad at all. I like this little crossbow. This thing's cool. This thing is very neat. Fight mental. Okay. Sure. Let's see. Kalinovka. Oh, it says it right there. Kalinovka. Okay. Comments on the level music. Peace track is really good. I also love the fight soundtrack a lot. I even think the Ryu Series and 4 soundtracks fit, at least in the setting, or like in the context. Oh, and that's Ivan. Or Ivan, however you want to say it. A oh, mental illness. Stop. One more step, and I will shoot. Easy, dude. Easy. Americanas. Who are you? Tell. My name's Sam Stone. I'm looking for some guy called Letoff. Ivan, what the hell? This is serious Sam. I told you he'll come. Put your gun down, you idiot. <sighs> My friend, I am so glad you are with us. Sorry about Ivan. He's a slow learner, you know. No worries. So, let me introduce myself again. I'm Igor Letov, and this is my valiant partisan squad. Natasha. Hi. Vlad. Hey. And I. <laughs> we are your biggest fans, man! Oh, boy. Oh, I'm flattered. Nice to meet you guys. Open the gate! So oh, look at that walk. There is a train depot at the end of this village. We saw a locomotive and some wagons over there. I am sure we can run that thing and use the train to move to the nearest town called Gustanov. You'll be able to get to Tunguska from there much easier, but... But? But we have to assemble the train, and there are too many enemies out there. 
We have to fight for the depot. Oh, here I thought it'd be something difficult. Let's roll. Sounds easy enough. We found a box with a new toy near the fallen ETF convoy. Wanna take a look? Is that even a question? Hell freaking yeah! Hi, guitar. Nice. Guy's got some taste. I would like to read that, but it's sideways. And I think it's in Russian too, so no dice. Yeah, Svit. Wait. Zbol. Zbolden. Spol. Svet. Peh. Okay, I, I give up on that one. That, that's a little too Russian for me. I can't. I can't even. Oh, now it plays. No copyright claims, please. This is just like an in-game guitar. Doo doo doo. I like it. Uh, hello. Uh. Okay. Uh, very well then. Nice. Thank you. <laughs> very cool. <laughs> what? <laughs> Why is that a thing? It's so good. Oh, I can't. Really? I can't tightrope walk across this on top of there and grab some shit? Ah, okay, fine. Be that way. See if I care. I would really like to explore that area. That looks nice. Oh, do you see that? He's like, zoom, zoomed on over. Invisible wall. No, I can't go over there. Darn. What about back... Vlad? Hey, how's it going, buddy? Blah. Oh, he's even got, like, the Russian military shirt with, like, the... Stripes going. That's awesome. Cool guy. I actually like the character designs. They actually don't look like idiots. Except for maybe you. You're something special. With your rose tinted ass glasses and your double assault rifle. Uh, okay. I guess I should call him like John Ledinov or some shit. Uh, lag spikes. Stop it. I command you. Hello. What are you? No way, dude. This toy looks great. Works even better. Get ready to rock. Just don't use it near Ivan. You know the beans. Hello, beautiful. What are you? Raygun. Experimental weapon developed by EDF. Let's see, early development stages. Oh, okay, so basically it's like reverse engineered draconium burner tech. Okay, let's see. Shoots a highly beam. Okay, da -da. Cool. Backwards compatible with draconian chem cells. Nice. So, let's see. Oh, interesting, interesting. Okay. So, 
basically, it it looks like it doesn't damage enemies outright. Well, it does. It does like 20 damage per second. But it looks like it has like a secondary thing where it like heats up targets and then like every time you get there it like does like 4 damage and then like 80 damage on top of that. So like 84 on top of like... That's a lot. Okay, let's see what it does. Also, um... Really quick, keyboard and mouse. I need to rebind that because that's not where I would want it. Probably gonna put you on 3 or something. Actually, you know what? I'll keep you on C. Let's see what happens. Ha, get it? C, what happens? Ha ha ho 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 Okay. Secret armor, nice. Am I a tourist? Uh, no, I've actually never been to Russia. I would love to go one day. I actually have a friend that lives in Croatia, so I'll probably visit him first. And then maybe, like, take a trip up. Because that sounds cool. I'd like to do that sometime. Maybe one day. Okay, I'm curious to try this thing out. Wonder if it has, like, a spin-up. Or if it's just, like, instant. Damn. Oh, cat does a crap ton of damage. Ooh, 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 ooh. That's some fire. That's some lag. <laughs> How do you like me now? Dude, this thing is sick. Oh, so I can basically just do this. Okay. You guys shouldn't have told me that. Spikes. Stop it. Laser. Oh, laser conveyor. Yeah, that would be kind of cool. I guess. Yo, this thing's awesome. True. Yeah, it is. Kind of reminds me a bit of like the. Oh my god, the lag spikes. Quit that. Yeah, it kind of does remind me a little bit of. What's it? Like. Well, the lightning gun. Yeah, the lightning gun. Or I guess like the thunderbolt from Quake 1. It'll come at me. I kind of wish that the teammates didn't follow you and that they, that they like literally just gave you the new weapon and said, okay, have fun. 
but eh, whatever, we'll see. Someone had borscht. Nice. I want borscht. That sounds good. Bitch, you did not just diss me. And down he goes. Hopefully the lag spikes stop. Yeah, uh, Quake 2 Railgun. That thing was fun. Nice. This ends good. Super armor. Okay. That's something you normally don't see that often. What could be down here, I wonder? Mines. Okay. Scarecrow. Interesting. Let's see. What else? What else do we got? Burner is just a better balanced version of the Death Ray. I could see that, yeah. Basically, they took like the overpowered weapons in Serious M4 and they just kind of merged them all into like different guns. So basically, they took like the whole sniper rifle Devastator debate thing and they just made this out of it. They took the whole minigun Death Ray debate and they just made this. It does actually have like a little bit of like a build up thing before it can shoot so yeah it's not really how I would have done it but you know what I'm cool with it at least for the DLC I mean it's a cool weapon in general plus it's something different I'm a little bit miffed that you don't get the minigun maybe I'm wrong maybe you do actually get a minigun later <laughs> Vodka, yes. Yes, my friend, I'll drink to that. Let's see. Da, da, da. What do I want to do? I have all the skills that I really want. Like, this is basically all the stuff that I would want right here. So... I guess I can experiment and go this way. Since I can bypass all this crap. Yeah, sure. I don't see why not. There is a minigun next level. Ooh, okay. I honestly thought that this would have just been like the minigun replacement for the expansion pack because, well, it has a charge up time. It's hit scan. It seems like it has a pretty decent range, but. Dunno. More damage on low health. When do I ever go low health? Never. And if I do, I deserve to die anyways. Uh, uh, 
the only way you can succeed is to learn from your mistakes, and if you like, ah, you know what, here's my trump card, I'm just gonna get out of here. Like, that's not fair. Nothing back here, okay. Armor shards, cool. I'll take those. Okay, performance in this area doesn't seem to be the best. Where'd you come from? You know what, let me get the ammo stash since it's right here. Yeah, there we Whoops, give me another one, thanks. Oh, I saw something. Yeah, there, there's like a gadget up there. Yep, okay. Give to me the scooter. Which I still haven't used, by the way. Alright, let's see what's going to happen up here. I have a feeling it's something bad. It's going to be a fight of some sort. really would have preferred these fights to be solo, but whatever. I could have used the airstrike at the beginning of the level against that huge kamikaze wave, but I honestly didn't even think about it at the time. The, th this area is nice looking. This area looks really nice. Very pleasing to look at. Yeah, that, that's annoying. I don't, I don't like the teammates. I didn't like the teammates in Serious M4, and I don't like them now. At least the designs look cooler. They don't look like... Well, they still don't look amazing, but they actually look like they took a little bit more time to make them look like something other than just, like, a mannequin. Eh, the eyes are still kind of weird. I don't know. Just don't put teammates in Serious M4, like, if I were to make friendly AIs... Grenade Launcher! Grenade Launcher! Grenade Launcher! Grenade launcher. 
Grenade launcher. I have it. It's mine. Took the game long enough. They even gave me a death ray before they gave me the fucking grenade launcher. <laughs> oh, this one's obvious. Actually, it's not. Okay. Well, still kind of obvious, but... Oh yeah, see, 12 out of 16, I'm actually doing pretty good. Ah, stretch, stretch, stretch. I don't know why, but like, level layout actually makes sense to me this time. True, but then again, this is only five levels and we're on the fourth level, so it took them pretty much till the end of the game to give it to me. They could have just given it to me without the mod on it, you know? Like, why, why didn't you do that? Why didn't you just give me the grenade launcher without the mod on it? And then saved it so that like, the mod would come like right at the end, you know? That would have made at least some sense. Jump pads! These things make a return. Okay, that's usually not a good sign. Black spikes. Okay, did you see him just like jump? <laughs> that was kind of funny. I'm just shooting whatever. Uh, quit that please. That was really fun. That was actually a really fun fight. Wow. I still think the fight would have been better without these idiots here, but... <laughs> Did you see the reload animation? <laughs> he just, like, uh, lowered his gun. Uh, oh my god, that's amazing. That's so funny. <laughs> How is Tim Masters opinion about Shadow Warrior 3? First of all, quit calling me that. Second of all, um, interesting, I think. I don't know. The, the thing that kind of bothers me is Flying Wild Hog has like this 
weird track record of making really bullet spongy enemies, but they try to do it in a way that's like Serious Sam, but it sucks. I know that this guy piss off a lot of people, and even myself to an extent, because I actually was a huge Shadow Warrior fanboy, like, of the reboots anyways. Like, I actually played Shadow Warrior 1, I thought, ah, hey, you know, this is okay. I think the enemies are too spongy, but, you know, I had, like, some fun here and there. Then Shadow Warrior 2 came out, and they, like, made it into, like, this weird looter shooter thing, which I didn't like, and then... I don't know, like, Shadow Warrior 3, it looks like it has the potential to be a really good game, but at the same time, like, I'm just worried that they'll go back to their hard reset roots and their original Shadow Warrior roots and just, like, make the enemies unbelievably spongy for no reason other just to have spongy enemies, if that makes sense. That's my biggest fear, is that they'll just make it spongy for the sake of being spongy. And also this guy. Yo, walk into this again like the idiot you are. Yeah. Pfft. What a goofball. Yo, come here. Come here, do it again. Do it again. Yeah. <laughs> Hold on. Come here. Do it again. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, this guy. I'm having too much fun watching this, sorry. I got distracted. <laughs> Anyways, um, let's see. Oh yeah, jump pad, let's take it. Oh, these open, I'm, I'm so blind. You know what, let's grab this stuff first before we exit. Just in case, you never know. Especially the crossbow bolts, we're actually pretty good on those, so now I just want to grab laser cells. And grenades. Need to use a grenade launcher at some point during this now. The thing is, is that they actually gave it to me so late into the game. Oh god. Why? Why would you want to protect that skanky ass hoe? I don't want her. Nobody wants her. She's like nasty old Rocheau from Left 4 Dead. I don't want that. Okay, well I guess we have no choice. Let's see. Let's do the fight. See what happens here. Ooh, the grenade launcher has a new sound effect that actually sounds good. Hell yeah! Now what? Demotion or a sensible career choice? Wait, protect the train so Ludov can run the train on Natasha? You mean like, yo, is he actually gonna road killer? Dude, yes. Okay, I'm gonna protect that train at all costs. But first I need to find out what the hell I need to do because apparently the game stopped and I heard something about a crane needing to be operated. Where's the crane? Where is the crane? Oh, and also this. Uh, this actually looks interesting because there's like a... Yeah, little red thing on it. Can I blow that open? No? How about C4? You got anything? Nah. I'll come back for it later. I think that's a secret. Yo, by the way, this grenade launcher sound effect... I'm in love. Oh! 
Hey! Hey! They actually brought back the Serious M2 sound effect. I'm actually like one of the few people that really likes the Serious M2 grenade launcher sound effects. Yo, that's clean. I actually wish the Sirius M4 got updated with like some of these minor changes because that's really good. Dude, the Sirius M2 sound effect is back, baby. Oh, and also listen to that. Yo, I'm, I'm gonna shut up really quick and I'm gonna have you guys listen to the sound effect when this thing hits. Just listen to the sound it makes when it hits the wall and tell me it doesn't sound cool. That's some good shit. Dude, that, that, is, that is chef's kiss. I love that sound effect. Please someone make a mod that brings these sounds of sound effects into Sirius M4. Please. I beg you. Whoever knows modding and can get these sound effects, please just port them over to Sirius M4. I need this in my life. Just like a good old fashioned sound effect fix. Or better yet, maybe Crow Team can go off their lazy ass and do it. That'd be cool. Oh boy, we have to do the mini game. Okay, let's see. So grab crane number one. We drop the thing. We grab the stuff. We move it out of the way. Okay, then we grab this thingy over here. Let's see. Drop. The game lagged. Okay, great. I'm going to bring this one over to me so that I can grab it, hopefully. Or it just falls off. Okay, that's even better. Here, you know what? Get... Eh, there. I'll just move it over here so that I can grab the armor. And actually... Is it me, or did the skybox actually just dynamically... Well, maybe not the skybox, but the actual brightness got brighter. Yeah, it did. Oh my god, the lag spikes. Stop that this instant. Stop that this instant, young man. auto shotgun shells for the auto shotgun I don't have. Yeah, I remember someone said that like it was a secret that I could get in the side objective area, but I didn't find it, so now I have shells for a weapon that I don't even get to use. That kind of sucks. Oh, hello kamikazes, how are you doing? Yes! The Octanians! They're making the sounds! <laughs> I love him, just there he is! Nah, I wanna fight! Ooh, good! Thank you, Sam!
<laughs> yes. Now this is Sam that I remember. Let's do a wielding. You know what, let's try it. What's the worst that could happen? Yo, that's awesome. Go get him, lads. Yeah, kick their asses back to the Stone Age. Oh, come on. Two rockets wasted. This is one for the history books, fellas. Cool. Uh, before we leave, though, let me check back here. Did you guys leave any secrets here for me to collect? No. Okay. Well, it was worth a try. I'm actually glad I saved this thing. That was really good. I think I'm going to use that strategy for when I actually record this level eventually. Because that seemed to work out really well. Just use airstrike there. Well, not airstrike, artillery strike, whatever. What bothers me about the train station is that it's full of trains which are out of use in modern Russia. Well, this kind of looks like a older, more industrial part. Well, if you live there, then obviously you would know, but... I don't know, I, th I think aesthetically, anyways, it looks pretty cool. would like to see some modern trains, though. That would be pretty nice looking. Especially if this is like supposed to take place in the future. Tact seems like an auto win. Hmm, true, to an extent. Mines, okay. How many secrets do I have? Thirteen, okay, so I missed three secrets. I don't know where they are. But, you know what? I think that was a pretty damn good fight, and also a good use of the gadget. I'm really happy I got to use the gadget and finally see what it did. And I'm not disappointed. That gadget actually came in pretty clutch, I have to admit. I don't think I'd be able to do that with the lag spikes anyways. Without the lag spikes, I might be able to do that fight, but with the lag spikes, yeah, just let that take care of it for me. I don't think I'll be able to do that. No, I'm not going to use the gadgets. I really don't want to. I want to experience the fights the way that... Cro oh. The way that it was intended to, you know? Hey, dude, listen. If there's some problem, we... Let's wash out our stress together. Ah, okay. Overall impression of the level... I would say that is the best level so far. Without a doubt. that That's the best level so far in this, this entire expansion pack. It was long, but in a good way. 
I think the only thing that kind of dragged it down a little bit was the fact that you had to fight alongside teammates, but I can imagine in the future someone will probably make like a reworked version of the campaign that just gets rid of the teammates and keeps the fights mostly intact. Heh, <laughs> get it? Tax. Because I use the gadget. Oh yeah, the fucking tank. I almost forgot about that. How could I almost forget about that? That thing is... Yeah, the, the tank is good, the opening kamikaze wave is awesome. Did you not die during the entire level? Wait, did I not die? I kind of forgot. Does anyone remember if I actually died during that level? I don't think I did. I might have died once, maybe? I actually can't remember. And you were in shock, okay. Well, this is the final level. Let's see how it goes. The Serious M2 train sound effect, hell yeah. here with us. He'd have appreciated this ride. I'm an atheist, Sam, but I knew and respected Father Mikhail very much. He was a good man. Real Russian. Let's drink for him. Real Russian. Oh, I love it. Our stop. Pack your guns and get your asses out. There's still some texture loading issues, but overall the presentation is really good for this expansion pack. Look at that! I mean, the mental banners. That's the kind of shit I was looking forward to. Like, it's it's the little things like that that make everything so much better. This is the only pre-track on this stage, so we will have to stop here. Well. Flowers. Very nice looking. An actual good Serious Sam quote to boot. Holy crap. Yo, we're back, baby. We're playing Serious Sam for real this time. Let's do this thing. doing this baby we're in it we're in the zone we're gonna beat the ship right here right now with 15 secrets okay yeah let's go give me more Climb on this? Nah. Okay. Fair enough. Let's continue. That's a big place. Um, let's see. Grenades. Yes. I'll happily take those. I I genuinely think this is probably the best modern serious same experience I've had since probably the fusion port of BFE. 
secret depot, and a secret fight to go along with it. Hell yeah, we are totally back. We're doing this. Oh, look at that wave. Yes. Oh, the enemies. The pun is appreciated, but I have a good feeling about this. This entire expansion pack has been an absolute joy to play through. And I, I have a feeling this level is going to be something great. I already like the music. The tension, bro. It's all here. We're doing this, boys. We're beating this today. I put this on for... I put this off for way too long and for... Well, for good reason, actually. But, we're here. And we have the minigun! And Seb said the funny. Hell yeah. Empty room of cannon. Okay, we are going to get a cannon. Soon. I have a feeling. I mean, we have to get a cannon. That's like serious and tradition. Is to get a cannon after you get the minigun. Aw. Oh. Death Ray is cool, but nothing beats a minigun. We're in it. We're in it, boys. This feels like home. I think the spread for the minigun is tighter. I haven't... let me... I don't know, it's still all over the place. Never mind. I wish that they basically did the thing where they just made it. Victory will be ours, hell yeah. Let's do this. Let's check back here first, though. Still want to explore a little bit. Let's see, some armor, that's cool. Anything else? Nope. Okay. How about... Nah, I can't destroy those. I wish... I so wish the performance was better. Because... If the performance was better, this would... Pretty much be like... A 10 out of 10 experience. So...
Okay. The performance is more stable than Sirius M4, but not by much. I still think that's their top pro. Well, I don't even think I know that that's their top priority. Like, like it has to be, you know? They, they can't just ignore it. Like, it's something that's plaguing the game from being enjoyed by people. Like, like, like even myself, like someone that has like a somewhat decent PC, like it's still lagging out for me, so I can't imagine how it is for other people, you know? Like, it literally keeps the enjoyment down across the board, and that sucks. Because there's a good game here. And for the most part, it is playable, but it could be smoother, you know? By the way, uh, before I progress, I actually did hear an enemy back here, I think. Yeah, I heard an enemy around here somewhere. I don't know where he is or what it is. That looks like a... Oh, I hear that. Are you gonna... Uh, hello? What? Okay? What? Interesting? Okay, so I, I wasn't crazy. I did actually hear an enemy back there. I thought he glitched out for a second. Nah, he, he was just stay Okay, he's just chilling. Sure. Oh, this looks like a big area. I'm just gonna pick it up and move on. Oh, the music. Is that a... Oh, it's a wearable statue. Never mind. Or like a painting. Never mind. I thought like the wearable got stuck in the wall. There you are, all the way back there. That's a new muzzle flash. I don't like it. Looks kind of low res. I actually prefer the 
basic serious and four one better. I mean, I like the fact that it's like a star shaped pattern, but it looks too small. You know, it looks like the star should be bigger and it should be like higher resolution too, probably. Also, yeah, okay, I knew it. So, what do you think? Go for the big courtyard? I think I'll pass for now and go over here. Do some exploration. Use the scooter once. I might use it for that fight coming up, just to test it out. I like experiencing the fights raw, though, without using gadgets. Sometimes gadgets are necessary, but not often. Ah, see you later, man. Thanks for joining them. Oh, and the canoes snap. I actually forgot about that. Yeah, they actually snap like they're supposed to. Makes dodging them a lot more... predictable. And that's a good thing. looks like an optional kind of side fight area. I'm gonna do it, see what we get from it. Or maybe not, maybe it's just like a shortcut to get over there faster. No, it is a secret, okay. Yeah, I knew that there had to be something here. They're, they won't give you all these supplies if they didn't want you to have a fight. want to grab. Is there anything over here? Besides a wall? No. Yeah, the park fight in Serious Sand 4 was awesome. Serious Sand 4 did have its moments, and the park fight was definitely one of them. Yeah, before we go over there, I'm gonna check this out. It's probably an ambush or something. So I'll actually get two of these ready. Secret Kamikaze Trap, yep. Hello. <laughs> I 
Okay, nice. <laughs> I still found a way to make it goofy. Cool. I don't want to use a scooter. I want to play this. I want to play it the way I want to play it. Glad that they're sidewinders. I'm really happy to see them make a return. Ivan is a national treasure. <laughs> nah, they have in the tricks entry, pretty sure. Enemies, there we go. Unless they're not actually in here. Huh. Well, that's weird, because I know for a fact that they have an entry. Like in Sirius M4. It's not like it's something new. Oh boy, an ice physics fight. My favorite. You know what, I'll use it here. Why not? Oh, hello. Oh. Okay, that's how it looks in third person. This is overpowered. It does have a timer on it, though. That's pretty good. Oh, damn you. And that's the scooter. Okay. Well, you got your wish. There's a the scooter. I thought it would have mitigated the ice physics, but it seems like the scooter still kind of slides on it. Maybe that's how it controls normally. That was probably a bad place to test it, actually. But, whatever. There you go. Scooter. It scoots. It does stuff.
Oh, there is like a container in the water. But there's nothing on it. Okay. That kind of sucks. I. Oh no, get out, out of the water, out of the water, out, 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 out. Eight. Okay. Oh, did they get stuck in the water? <laughs> nice. I'm just gonna grab this stuff really quick. Hope y'all don't mind. Okay, we should be good now. Also gonna do a quick little check over here in case there's anything I missed. Nah, doesn't look like it. Okay. Onwards. Did they actually get stuck in the water? Like a bunch of idiots. Does that mean that they'll die and that they'll spawn back up here? Bomb. Okay. Cool. Laser cells. Also cool. Where are they? Guess doesn't really matter. It was a say. Cool Sam is the best. Oh, there they are. Wait, there actually is something though over there. Can I get that please? I'm gonna actually make a quick save here because I don't wanna... No, there's an invisible wall. Well, wait a second, how are you supposed to get that thing if there's an invisible wall over there? Maybe you get to that area later on? I'm not sure. Or, maybe you can just kinda walk along this? No? Nah, it doesn't seem like it. Oh, well, one of them made it. Hey, there's two. Do you guys follow me out of here? Or no? You guys stuck, aren't you? Yep, they're stuck. Bunch of idiots. Probably 500. I don't, I don't want to overdo it because then it doesn't become a special if you like do it like every 50 subs. I think 100 is a fair milestone to achieve. Like every 100 or so you do a subscriber milestone thingy. This thing is awesome. There we go. Oh wait, they're right. Well, one of them is here. Vlad, doing the backwards strafe with the super shotgun, is clipping through his torso. Cool. Very cool, Vlad. Thank you. And it looks like I can go over there, too. Mm, you know what? Let's, let's try that. Let's see. Can I actually make it over there? Is that wall extend? Nah, it looks like it extends. That's a shame, I actually wanted to climb up those stairs and see what's over there. I mean, it actually kind of looks like a place you could go to. Yeah. Eh, whatever. I just felt like shooting that. Grab this stuff. Okay, what's over here? I saw something. Ammo. Okay, nice. And I'm still 
gonna keep that in my mind, that there's like a gadget over that way. Oh, the music is good. I love it. I like the weapons. I definitely like the weapons as an expansion pack. Even though there's only like two sort of brand new guns, I think both of them are really good and also think the AK is way better than the assault rifle ever was. Just because it's an AK. Still wish the top cover didn't have that little Picatinny rail on it, but whatever. I'll take it. And behind door number one is more uglies. Nice. Today you don't. jump up this? No. That's a shame. I wanted to go up there. Maybe there's a different way. Oh. Can you do something with this valve? No. Door? No. Are the fights too easy for me? Hmm. They are getting a little bit samey. Just a little bit, though. Inconsistent ladders. Again? Like they always say, follow the cables. Words to live by. Follow the cables. Okay. Well. Let's take a look. I kind of want to go down the road first. This way. Hopefully get myself a snowmobile or something. Also, I want to get to where that secret is because I know it's down here. I know it is. I saw you. Oh, harpies. Nice. Okay, give that to me. I wonder if it's going to spawn in like a fight. Yeah, okay, that that seems about right. Okay, bring it on. You know what, maybe I should... Nah, forget it.
Actually, what am I doing? I have this. Yeah, there we go. Wait, what's this about a cave at the gate? Hmm. Let me see. Is there anything up here? No, there's an invisible wall. But of course. Wait, am I stuck? Yo. Oh, okay. Um, I'm out. Inconspicuous. Yeah, okay. Nope. Uh, yeah, sure. No ambush here. Yeah, this one's pretty obvious. Okay. Generator thing. Wait. I hear him. Okay. Yeah, fights are starting to get a little easy at this point. Kind of expecting, like, some surprise ambushes soon, though. Like this. That didn't blow a hole in the side of the... Ah. You know, I think these explosive barrels are kind of missed opportunities for secrets. Like, you can destroy parts of the wall or something to jump over. But no such luck. It's just... Eh. Okay, onwards. Let's see what we have. By the way, I wonder if there's anything under the little elevator before it closed. Or went down, I should say. I guess there's only one way to find out. Let's see, so we jump on it, where's the activation switch? It is right here. Up you go. No, nothing. Okay. And now the gate's open. Cool. Okay, let's progress through it. Uh, there is a pipe here, though. Ooh, hello. No fall damage, please. Thanks. 
Oh. Oh. Interesting. I think someone mentioned something about a cave and I kind of forgot about it already, but... Okay. There's a door here. It's a tech nuke launcher and a bunch of reptiloids standing around it. Okay. Oh! Yeah, come over here. Yeah, there you go. Oh, they're gonna target him. Ha ha ha, Carter. Yeah, the person who's always talking about the lizards. Very funny. He's still alive, isn't he? Yeah, he's still alive. Cool. What now? Nah, just let the bullets guide you. Works for me so far. The bullets will guide you. I haven't seen a cannon yet. Yeah, that's like the one weapon that we're missing. Okay. Well, I haven't seen the final boss, so no spoilers. I kind of have a feeling it's General Brand, but I still don't want that spoiled for me. I just have a feeling, though. I mean, his plane did get shot down, like, in the previous, well, two levels ago, so I'm assuming we're gonna have, like, an encounter with him at some point. Or maybe it's, like, a Guardian or something. Who knows? We'll see. This is my first time playing it, but I have a feeling it's him. It just seems logical, you know? But don't tell me if it is or not, I still want it to be a surprise. Okay, and a non-secret, uh, what's this thing called? Hover drone gadget thing. Ah, uh, well thank you so much for sticking around, hope you get some good sleep. Doesn't look like there's anything back here. What do I have? Okay, I have ten secrets, which means there's only five to go. That's not bad. Who knows, maybe I'll actually find all the stuff for once. That would be a nice change. There it is, the cannon. Let's make this canonical. Canonical, indeed. Very funny, Sam. Enemy riding. Okay, we have it. Oh boy, look at that battlefield. That's just begging for me to explore it. Uh, before I do, I'm actually going to head in the opposite direction, as you normally would. This is usually like where secrets are. It's in the opposite direction at big battles. See? What did I tell you? There's already something over here. What do we get? A Rage Serum. Ooh, okay. Anything here? No? Well, okay. Let's do this thing. See how we fare against... You know what I just realized? I don't know where my cannon is. Oh! Oh, is that so? Okay, that's not going to do. Okay, so the cannon is here. Um, you know what? Yeah.
Well, let's see how this goes. I'm expecting the worst. We'll see, though. We'll see how this goes. We have plenty of gadgets, though, to help ourselves through this if things get too tough. I'll try not to use them that much, though. I want to... Kamikazes. Okay, just like a little sprinkling of kamikazes. Not a bad way to start off a fight. Okay. Wasn't so bad. Oh, what do you think about Russia, Sam? Pretty much the way I imagined it. Golden Snowy? Half brave, half crazy, and 80% alcohol. That actually wasn't that bad, okay. Oh, there's still more. Okay. Well, I say that, I don't really see anything. Oh, we're bold, okay. We're bulls. Oh, that's quite a bit. Okay. I might actually die. Call it down there. Go. Get him. Yeah, you can't stop that, can you?
almost broke a sweat. Hell yeah! We are awesome! Oh, it's still going, okay. Raiders! Looks like they're trying to level this town to the ground. We might want to step up the pace a bit. We are right behind you, Drug. Drug. Ah, yes. Very nice. Well, that was eventful. Damn. <laughs> that was a big fight. Had to actually use a few gadgets there. Alright, up the hill we go. Yeah, fight without gadgets, that one in particular probably would be hard. I guess it's kind of good that you get to save up on your gadget sort of for these bigger fights. Kind of balances them out a little bit more, but even then I'm still kind of stocked on them, as you can see. I mean, what, I have like two airstrikes, four health gadgets, a nuke that I haven't even used. I probably could have used it back there, but eh, whatever. There's a secret up ahead, you say. I also like how the hatchlings kind of have like their more classic sounding death sound. That's a really nice touch. Yeah, I should have used my nuke, probably. I mean, I, I do have it. But, eh. You know, I kind of wish that they gave you a serious bomb instead of a nuke. That's still my biggest gripe, is that... Why give you a nuke launcher, you know? Like, you could just have the serious bomb make a return. That'd be cool. Do that. Oh, those just kind of appeared. Nice. Eh. Let me get up there. I want it. Wait, secret inside one of the smaller buildings. Hmm. Let's see. Which one could it be? Which one could it be? I don't know. I mean, I saw that there was like an open door, but I think that's the place that you're supposed to go to. Maybe it is a secret. I'll check it out, actually. Yeah, because I actually did see an open door over here. So there's the gate, right? 
But over here you have this. Oh, oh, I think this is the one you were talking. Oh, I, I actually did see this. Okay, so I'm not blind. Okay, another one of these, huh? Secret classic area. Oh boy, this fight. Again, I switched the pistol out for this because it's easier to reach. Damn it. Okay. Cool. Oh, even better. Super armor. And more cannonballs to grab. Ah, those crispy pickup sounds. How I miss them. So delicious. Okay. Well, that was fun. Wasn't too bad, but hey, nice little secret fight. I enjoy it. And this opens very slowly. What happens here? Wait. I know them. This is Pavlov's squad. <laughs> Who did this? Something's wrong. I don't like this. What do you mean? Shit! Oh shit, it's him. Brand, you should be glad to see me, Stone. The universe has given you a second chance. Surrender, and your friend lives. Let him go! Don't you see what's happening, Stone? Don't you see how pointless this whole heroic struggle of yours is? You kill one villain, another takes his place. You win battle after battle, and yet you're still losing the war. And friends keep dying. Make the pragmatic choice, Stone. Stop resisting. Play your part. D don't listen to him! Better be dead than surrender to this goddamn padla! Wrong answer. Oh shit. Fuck, fuck, fuck! That bastard's gonna pay for this. So did I, but I guess that was wishful thinking. You guys okay? We're fine. Not sure that we can climb over that mess, though. Is there another way to the dam? Yes, we're actually closer to it than you. You'll have to make a little detour. All right, stay there. Find a place to lay low. I'll make my way alone this time. Yeah. <laughs> That's not gonna happen, Stone. Think about your team, man. We are fine. And we are ready to kick some ass for Ivan. That's my girl! I see you at the damn Sam. Damn. That was actually pretty well done. You can actually hear like the Yeah, you actually heard like the terror in his voice. That was wow. Oh, okay. A lot better voice acting than I was expecting. Wow. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's let's continue. Shit. I feel bad for the guy. That was brutal. Hey, at least we're alone for a bit. That's cool.
level seems a bit stretched to you. Uh, mm, kind of. That big battle, though, was pretty cool. Well, for those that didn't see the earlier missions, like in level 3, it actually starts out with you shooting Brand's plane down. Well, not you, but basically the basically like the plane that's carrying him gets shot down, so I think that's why they thought he was dead. Oh, nice, we get to fight some guard towers. These things are always cool. They're actually kind of dangerous, too, so hopefully I don't die to them. Igor, can you hear me? Guys? Damn, looks like they turned the radio off. Whoops. Ah, I keep forgetting that I switched to pistol. Damn it. Okay, where is the weak point on this thing so I can kill it? Oh, is it on the other side? I think it's on the other side. Okay, reveal your weak spot. Do the thing. I quit lagging already. Uh, 
There we go. Oh my god, these lag spikes. What a... Use the gadgets. Never. I don't feel like it. Besides, why would I do that? I already have supplies back here I can grab. They're right around here somewhere. Yeah, I think this is it. Let's see. Super health and... Nope. It's back here. Yeah, here we go. Nice. Okay, we're fully stacked for whatever comes next. I see people in the chat saying final boss time, so I guess that means we're pretty close. I actually like that tower fight, like where the weak point's actually on the opposite side and it has like this little barrier over it. That's pretty cool. Definitely like the concept of this fight, and I think it played pretty well too. Like the little wearable surprise at the end. Very nice. Okay, and I think this is the dam. And also, is it me or is this different? Oh yeah, it's red. So I guess that this is actually... Like, the 200 health pickup that never got to show up in Sirius M4. Okay, here it goes. Let's see what happens. And there he is. Here goes, let's see how this ends up. Alright, come at me, boy. Okay, not bad, not bad at all. Yep. Nice.
Oh shit, okay, what do I do now? Ha! <laughs> He's trying to do like some WWE move on me. Ah shit, okay. Okay, let's try that again. Let's see how we do. General Brand, the last human. Wait, did my game just crash? Ah, oh, you gotta be kidding. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> okay. Thank you. Thank you, Serious Sam. Wow. Stupid thing. Okay, come on, let's try the... <laughs> Use the burner. Oh yeah, I forgot I have that thing, don't I? Stupid game. Okay, let's see how we do. The achievement for being in without mid battle loads is painful to get. Ah, uh, hmm. Well, we'll see. We'll see. First phase is actually kind of what I was expecting. Second phase seems to be a bit trickier. I gotta figure out his uh, attack pattern though, because first phase actually seems pretty easy. I mean, it is still kind of difficult. Some of his attacks have like a wide area of effect on them, but. I don't know, like, uh, second phase, I need to kind of learn his attack patterns on that one because they seem to be a little more eccentric. I have a brilliant idea. I know he's immune. <laughs> an asshole with a magic wand, I like that. Uh, hi, snakes. What the fuck? Oh, wait, I did it? That was it? This can't be happening. I made all the right choices. I am the last human. All the right choices, huh? That's funny. I spent a lot of time thinking about what turned you into a traitor. Was it fear? Delusion? Greed? You know what I realized, Howard? You're a fucking idiot. That felt really good. Huh? Hey, Sam! Who are you? I'm you, from the future. It's complicated, just roll with it. Eh, it's not the weirdest thing that's happened this week. Alright, listen up. I know it's really cool that you killed Bran, but this timeline does not end well. Believe me. I've seen every variation. I shot Napoleon like you said, but the future is still the same. Yeah, I figured as much. 
Honestly, I just wanted someone to shoot that little twerp. Anyway, Sam, Olga, I've got a mission for you. Now, back in 1352 BC, the Pharaoh Akhenaten has just discovered a buried Syrian ship. Uh, okay. Wait, that was it? Yeah, I don't get the time travel ending. Why why was that why was that there? What? I mean, it takes place between like d doesn't this take place between like, you know, the I I, I don't know. I don't know anymore. I I thought that Eh? That's it. I mean, the brand boss fight was cool. I think the brand boss is cool. It actually... Yeah, like, this doesn't take place between the oil rig and the final level, and for whatever reason they decided to do, like, this stupid-ass, like, time travel ending thing that, like, retconned everything, like, why? You know? It was supposed to be, like, a simple, like, oh, this is between the oil rig and, like, the other thing, but nope. You killed Brand, now we're gonna have you go through this. Like, I thought, like, at the end, you know, it would've been something cliche, like, just... You know, you kick his ass really good, and he's like, this isn't over, Sam, not by a long shot, and then he, like, jumps off into the sunset. Like, I thought that's how it was gonna end, you know? But, nope. That's stupid. This is also take place between like whatever. That's so dumb. That was actually a really cool boss fight too, and it's just like, huh, nah, just kidding. It doesn't actually happen. Well, okay then. And did my game just crash again? No, it didn't. Okay. Options. Game options. Sar Cannon. From Russia with Love. Okay. That boss is actually kind of doable. First try. I just didn't know what to expect for the second phase. Let's see, review of the game. So, uh, let's pull up the old menu. Mission number one I thought was good, but it had way too many invisible walls. Mission number two, also good, had a similar problem. Lots of invisible walls that kind of cut off exploration. Mission number three, I think it's good, but the opening section is too big for its own good. Once you get past the church and get, like, the crossbow, then it you know, kind of focuses and it gets good again. But the opening kind of section area, it's cool on the first playthrough, but it just kind of overstays its welcome a little bit. Roadside Picnic. Very condensed, very action-packed, good pacing, fights are excellent. You don't have all the weapons yet and you're still getting new stuff, so it feels fresh. Probably my favorite level. Crime and Punishment. Um, like, it actually does start out good for the most of it for the most part, you know. Uh, I will agree, it feels like it kind of drags on for a little bit, kind of in the midsection, and the boss fight is fantastic. Boss fight is 10 out of 10. Probably the best boss fight 
Well, actually, it is the best fight in a series, or the best boss fight in a serious Sam game because he actually has attack patterns, and you can avoid most of his attacks. So yeah, that that's my thoughts on it. Uh, all around, really good. I enjoyed myself. Now you know what I'm gonna do. I'm actually gonna go back and just replay it. <laughs> I don't know how long I'm gonna do this for, I'm just gonna replay it from the beginning and see if I got any better at the game, or if I got worse. Sometimes you get worse after you beat it, sometimes you get better, but I don't know. Okay, well, thanks for dropping in. It was really fun to have you here. And everyone else. Right, I'm just gonna skip the opening cutscene because no one needs to see that. Alright, let's see if I'm any better at this. Sorry, the only thing on the menu is lead. Uh, how do you jump over this again? already stuck at the first obstacle. This stupid wall. How do I jump? Oh, just like that. Okay. I think there was something back here, right? Like, this doll? I'm not sure what that does still. Like, I'm, I'm sure it unlocks something, I just don't know what it does. Wish it had a hard boss track. Yeah, that'd be kinda cool. I don't know how long I'm going to replay this for, I just kind of want to see if I'm better at the game now that I've had the chance to play through it from beginning to end. Oh yeah, my least favorite enemy. Are you guys dogs or frogs? Just make up your damn mind. Yeah, Sam's knife is pretty powerful. You don't want to underestimate it. Oh wait, I could just do this. Yeah, I forgot that you can actually just melee them. Yeah, just press the E on them. Shit. Okay. Okay, not bad, not bad. That's an ambush. Actually, you know what? I have an idea. I have an idea. Just to make things a little bit more interesting. Does anybody have Serious Sam Siberian Mayhem yet? Besides me.
I want to try this. Yeah, sure, let's co-op. Whoever has it, come on in. I'm just going to start a random-ass lobby and see how this goes. So let's see. Uh, what we're going to do is we're going to play on serious difficulty. We're going to set the enemy multiplier to... I think two should be... or three. Yeah, let's do three. Just to spice things up a little bit. We're also going to keep... Uh, let's see... Yeah, we're going to get rid of extra enemy strength because I don't want them to turn into bullet sponges. Uh, inver un I don't want anyone to speed... I, I hate speedrunners, just so you know, so I'm going to set like invulnerability to like 5 seconds instead of 10 seconds because I don't want people to just like, you know, force their way through kill barriers or whatever and do stupid shit, so... If you speedrun, I'm going to kick you in the face, so don't do that. Alright, I'm just going to start this and whoever decides to join will join. Also, let me see, I need to do something with like the microphone, don't I? Yeah, I'll keep it like push to talk. I don't really know if anyone else is going to join this, but we'll see. Alright, so far it's just me. I'm going to wait a little bit and eat some fries. that I know... Actually, let's see. Invite friends. Do I have any friends that are... Ah! You know what? We do have a few people. Let me see if I can invite them. Let's see how this goes. I invited two people. I'm curious. I want to see like if this actually works in co-op. That's right, give me a second. see how this goes. Alright, so I'm gonna let uh, 
Reba there load in all the way and then there's still one slot open for like a random person to join so who knows it looks like their pain's pretty dang high though Oof. yeah let's hope this thing is stable Skyfall bosses are much cooler than brand. Ooh, okay. Sorry. The only thing on the menu is lead. I want to play Skyfall, damn it. I want that mod to come out already so I can just get it. Drake it is. Okay. Oh shit, that's a lot of Nars. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> well obviously since I'm the one playing it, it's stable. I don't know how it is for these guys though. Hopefully it's okay. Looks like they're kicking some ass. I don't really see them teleporting around or anything. Oh, did he notice that? Nice detail. Love to have those grenade sounds in Sirius M4. Rusev does a shit ton of ports, so I know he would probably be able to do it if anyone could. Oh, look at all the enemies. Oh, uh, what a... Fantastic, look at these things. Ow. <laughs> Ah, 
<laughs> oh. <laughs> Great. <laughs> Yo, I want Ken Kane as a player model. Let's see, I think you walk along this and then you grab this thing, right? Oh, shit, I fell off. Whoops. Platforming still sucks, even after all this time. Clear Kenny would be good. I like Clear Kenny. Yay, the rocket launcher has returned to us. Here they are. <laughs> I like how we just like fired and sink. That's good. Surprised no one's joined yet. I sent it to public, didn't I? It's not just friends only. <laughs> nice. The double kill. Paper. Oh boy. Feeling cold? Don't worry. I'll warm you up with my bullets. Oh, I hate these things. Oh shit! What? Nars, get out of here. There's something over here. At least I'm pretty sure. Wasn't there like something behind this rock? No. Huh. He has found the secret explosives. Okay. I don't even know where he is. I'm just kind of wandering around. Oh yeah, there's something back here, I think. Behind this cabin. Yeah, there we go. I got some rockets. Yeah, serious in. I, I like the drones. They're pretty fun to fight. Just get to kill them, and yeah, you know, they're cool. Every day, once a day, give yourself a present. Now, where was the secret explosive thing that you picked up? 
I think it was over here, wasn't it? No, that's just armor. But still nice to have. Oh yeah, this is the one with the Biomex. away from the side quest, okay? Yeah, the drones are pretty easier, like... Yeah, because they kind of sit still when they attack, so you can just kind of predict, like, where they're going to aim. idea where the explosives are he was talking about. Oh wait, this one. Yeah, I think I remember this one. Yeah, that's right. There's like this weird side objective thingy that you had to do, like where you came over came all the way over here. Yeah, I grabbed the not secret rockets. Okay, so the C4 is over here. Gotcha. Oh, C4 charge, you shall be mine. <laughs> 265 shells. I don't think I'm supposed to have that many. I forgot that it actually doubles your stuff. A player model. Nice. continue Ah, oh, so annoying the little uh, 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 jump <laughs> Was there something back here and uh, I can't remember I don't think so. Yeah, let's just go up there. That's where all the other boys are. Ooh. 
Ooh, a classic Serious Sam skin. Okay, that's pretty cool. I love how the animation for grabbing the <laughs> grenade launcher is still just jank. <laughs> Nice. <laughs> okay, what's spawning in these stupid bomber men? It's actually easier with three players, I think. Excuse me? Oh, okay. Just zip right through it. So there is something in there. How? What? Where, Where did he get the ladder from? I knew there had to be a secret in there. Like, I remember, like, when I first streamed, there was a secret. <laughs> Wait, what do you mean? Oh, wow. Okay, well, that helps. I'll, I'll try to remember that. So you can. I didn't even think to do that. I feel really dumb now. I, I don't know why I didn't think to jump in there from the bridge. Well, I didn't know about the ladder. That's pretty cool. Oh, you jump from the bridge, art man. Well, you're way smarter than I am, because I didn't even think to do that. Oh, this this cool little fight. <laughs> Look at those, they're just like lobbing grenades down there like a bunch of idiots. 
That's beautiful. Yeah, just keep it going, boys. Yeehaw. Yeah, just throw all the grenades that you want down there. You can't kill it. You can't beat me. <laughs> nice! He's <laughs> went into the flame. <laughs> oh, it's so good. A little puff of smoke, just pack. Oh yeah, I forgot that we have like a shit ton of rockets because of like the enemy multiplier. It also multiplies your ammo, so. Yeah, I, I shouldn't really be afraid to use it. Yeah, just rifle grenades for the win. Have at him, lads. Hey, welcome back. How you doing? Wait, what? Where? What secret? Oh. Oh, that's a secret? Wow, okay. I guess this- I guess my buddy here is just gonna lead me to where all the secrets are. Shit, I don't even have to do any of the hunting myself. He'll just show them to me. You have a good day, or I have a good day? Bone oh, bone to be wild. Hmm. That's so special. Oh, these annoying pricks. Actually, it might be easier in co-op. Let's see. Maybe it won't. Oh, okay, nice. Oh, yeah, the clears. Another one. <laughs> wow. Wow, that's fucking easy. Just get your buddies to play the game with you. Damn, okay, that, that just made it so much easier. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Fantastic work. <laughs> Look at that! <laughs> oh my god, that's the best! Dude. It's like fucking Squidward, Squidward hands. Incredible. <laughs> Oh yeah, I actually do remember the secret rockets. They're back here. Yeah, yes, that's right. Here they are. I actually did find those on my first playthrough. Which was over a week ago. God, how crazy. I can't believe I've slept on this game so long. It's so good. Wait, oh yeah, wait, can you get back there? Where? Oh, right here. I didn't even know about that. Damn, okay.
Oh, that's a lot of processed. <laughs> Quit blowing yourself up. <laughs> oh my god, this guy's incredible. Okay, yeah, the, these guys aren't going anywhere. We got locked down to a T. This is like the perfect formation to just kick ass in. God, this is fucking hilarious. <laughs> Is an Octanian Harvester basically a central processing unit? Pretty much. According to the lore, that's what it is. And up we go. See you later, fucker. Hey, don't shoot me, <laughs> bitch. <laughs> oh! oh yeah. Things are okay when you have an AK. Things are okay when you have an AK. Just remember that, kids. Oh shit, I'm dead. Yeah, I'm so dead. Okay. Yeah. Fuck, okay. <laughs> oh shit, okay. Die. Die. This is so fun. <laughs> Yo, do I have this set to friends only? Because I'm genuinely surprised that no one else has joined yet. I mean, there's still one more slot available if someone wants to hop in. Where? This guy's a... This guy's an enigma. Where, where does he keep finding all this shit? Oh, this... Okay, I actually did know about this one. Yep, there it is. I found that one on my first playthrough, too. Still, though, he's just, like, so fast. And speedy. Oh, okay, so basically... Show me... Show me where they're at. Oh yeah, I also love how the Scrapjack just like starts laughing when he sees you. That's so good. <laughs> Let the Scrapjack just all like, oh, oh, oh. Adds a little bit of personality to him, you know? Got it. Got your back, buddy. Where is the... Oh, right there. Okay. That's not too bad. Alright, show me the secrets. Where are they at? Stuff back there. That's nice. I'll take... More health is also very welcome. Like having health. And through the door I go. I love her all just like huffing. It's so good. I'll just like smoke in the herb before the big battle. Time warp, okay.
Oh yeah, this is a cool battle. Yeah, this is a cool battle with like all the jump pads and stuff. And it's super laggy. Holy crap, it's laggy. And with three times the amount of enemies? Oh god. Okay, that's a lot of kamikazes. I'm gonna grab this stuff. I'm gonna run over here. I'm gonna throw a grenade against the wall just because I can. Okay, and then clear the jump pad, jump up, take care of these guys. Then we're gonna jump back down, take this one, kill the Nar so he doesn't corner us. Shoot a grenade behind us, kill these. Run, grab the health, touch this, jump. Then we're gonna jump down and miss the health. I didn't want to do that, I wanted to grab it. We're probably gonna die anyway. Oh, wait, there's some stuff here. Okay, cool. Hold them off a little bit over here, and Kamikaze got me. Nice. I was actually doing pretty well. I thought I was gonna make it through that, but nope. I could have taken a life gadget, but eh, it's co-op. I mean, why? There's no penalty. This encounter in particular is just so good. What, the boxes? Oh. Oh, okay. Hey, it's this room with the Tommy gun! Oh, shit, the frog room. Okay, let's see what happens. I guess it's gonna be more of those stupid hopper things, right? Yep. Only there's three times the amount there normally would be. Okay, that's pretty bad. Oh, shit. Yeah, I, I hate these things. Ah, that sucks. Oh, clears too. Okay, nice. Just to add a little bit of icing on the cake. Ooh, the heart. Nice. Very cool. Wait, where was the 16th one? I didn't see it. Plus 10 in classroom. Oh. <clears throat> okay, well, that made my job a lot easier. At least I know where all the secrets are in this map now. The classic room is behind the boxes. Okay. 10 armor is on the doorway. Oh! Oh, I get it now. Okay, I, I know where he's talking about. He, he means, like, you jump on top of the doorway and there's, like, that little ledge that has the helmet on it. Cool, good to know. I didn't know you could do that. I do know about this secret though, like the mega armor that's inside the box, or the crate. 
Yep, there it is. Give me that. And where's the ladder to escape? I think it's... I should have just followed him. I don't know where to go. Oh wait, the ladder is back here somewhere. Yeah, there it is. I'm gonna let him keep going up, and then I'll follow him. I also do know about this one, too. You can jump on this and go up there. Yeah, there we go. Grab that. Okay, and then... Press the switch. He just speed... He just fucking speed drawn it. Okay, amazing. <laughs> Let me do that. See ya. Have a nice swim. I didn't even know you could do that. <laughs> Wait, can you jump on that? Yo! They can jump on it. Dude, that's awesome. <laughs> Yo, that's sick. <laughs> you can just jump on top of the crane. Okay. <laughs> what fabulous friends I have. <laughs> Ooh, I made it! Hey! Yo! Yo, you see a sick jump? <laughs> Bro! I almost made it over the wall, damn it. <laughs> that would have been so cool. Alright, let's get this shit, boys. Charge. Yeah. And down it goes. Nice. Where? Where do you keep finding this ship? Where? Never any power when you need it. I was a oh it's back there. Duh, okay. These guys are too good. I did. Yeah, you're supposed to go back here and there's like a switch and this opens up. Yeah, see? Not a secret, but still pretty cool. I see, okay. Oh. Okay, I guess we can lure them in here and fight them like this. It's pretty neat. Here, die. Well, I have to make a video on this at some point in the future, so... 
that means I'll have to do the final boss without dying without saves anyways. So, yeah. <laughs> Won't really call that much of, much of an achievement as much as it is like a goal. Goal is to beat him without dying. I did know about that one too. Don't know if there's anything else in this room though. Maybe he'll show us. Alright, let's do this Texas style, boys. And you'll lose. I don't know why it's so funny. <laughs> Just, and you'll lose. Oh, hi. God, we're just like popping off, damn. <laughs> this is like the elite squad of serious Sam players, what the fuck? <laughs> Yo, the gun glows when you shoot it? Dude, that's fucking awesome. I'm a sucker for shiny things. Oh. Yeah, I know about the rockets. Bro, since when did I get like this fucking elite squad assembled of just like professional killers? What the fuck? <laughs> These guys are incredible. Especially this guy, he's just like a machine. Look at him. He's played so long his... What? Where'd that? I know that there's a secret back here. Is this what he's talking about? Gotta jump over a cliff. Okay. Why you called it a fucking snow woman, but sure. Fun fight time, boys. Okay, now back to the hangar for my reward. You looked at I what? What do you mean I looked at? Looked at the secret? Oh yeah, here he is, the big bastard guy that like teleports around. I have rockets, what am I doing? Ow. Stop it. <laughs> Stupid kamikazes. I don't even know if that killed him. I think someone killed him before the grenade hit. That's always a fun fight. I actually found that secret like a while back. I, I took like the 
what's it called, like a little jet ski thing and I just like bumped into it and it exploded. I was really confused. Oh boy, what's he doing? Yo, co-op vehicles would be badass, so... It's gonna kill me. <laughs> what?! <laughs> Poor Scooter! I know about this one already. This one's pretty fun. Get some wearables to try to ambush you once you grab this. Oh my. I, I just hear him like raging over there. What? Oh my. Why did he spawn already? Okay, great. No, oh, away with you. <laughs> Fucker. I think there's one more. Oh, oh yeah, the return fight. I forgot all about this. His enemies. And we kill the enemies, because that's what we do. I also like how the Biomech's just asleep over there. He doesn't even know that we're standing over here. Well, he's not asleep. He's, like, patrolling around. Nice. Man, we're breezing through this. I should have just played this in co-op. <laughs> Yo, what are you doing? That was a ping. Plus. Okay, nice. So we got good performance going. Okay. That's good. At least we know that the co-op is stable. Okay. 
to step on them? Okay, great. <laughs> Go for it. Not gonna stand in your way. Okay, cool. At least I know what to expect. Here it goes. This is extremely uncool. Oh, haha. -ha. Ow. Okay, yeah. I'm gonna let these idiots do it. You can, but it's like guaranteed that he'll. Yeah, that, that's not good. You have to... Take care of the drones, and then we take care of the pyros. Actually, let's take care of the pyros first. They're a little bit more dangerous. see secret armor there we go grab that oh I guess someone already got it <sighs> nice job just stands in front of it and instantly gets shredded I think I like the drones better than the floaters, they have a bigger hitbox, and they make less annoying sounds. Okay, I just have like this fucking elite squad of like flaming assault rifle guys. <laughs> so funny, I love it. Having like my own personal little army. Oh, I remember this one. Oh yeah, look at all them pills, boy. Ooh. Nice.
Okay, so I don't have to worry about any secret hunting. It's oh shit. Okay, hi. Headshot, nice. Saw the little hit marker thing appear for it. Uh, let's do full speed ahead. Sure, why not? And down the sewer we go. <laughs> nice. Just ended their torment. <laughs> A giant robotic chainsaw arm. That's four words that were meant to go together. God, what a spectacle. <laughs> a mech with a chainsaw. I love Russia. Okay. Ah, hell yeah, let's do this. <laughs> nice. Yeah, this is some good shit. <laughs> I still think this mech section is actually pretty impressive. The fact that it's even working is pretty good. I mean, look how much shit there is. Like, three of these guys walking around and all this... I also do like the muzzle flashes on the arachnoids. I think that's good. It kind of reveals their position a little bit better. Where are they? Ah, here they are. This is glorious. What do you mean I cheated? Such accusations. Oh, we're still enemies. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> what portal?
Oh, low power, okay. I don't know. Where's the C4? Oh. Oh, okay. Let's take a look. What does he want to show me? True. Very true, yeah. I don't know, the little micro stutters are starting. No. Oh, door be nice to me. Oh, he already did it. Okay. Oh, and the lag spikes have returned. No. Just don't do it while I'm trying to do this section. <laughs> nice. Fantastic work. <laughs> also, that gave me a lot of C4. I have all 30. Damn. This is actually really fun. Yo, if you got a friend that has this, fucking get them to play co-op with you. So, eight secrets before the crossbow.
Okay, well, this should be interesting. I don't know if it's just me, but I feel like I have more skill points this time around. <laughs> I don't remember. I don't remember if I... I actually don't know if I found this. Okay, I know where the oil, oil columns are, so it shouldn't be too much of a problem. Hi, Kamikaze. How are you doing? the last one. I think this is it. Yeah, there we go. Oh, up here. Okay. Huh, I actually didn't find that one. <laughs> nice. Oh, it is going in the opposite direction.
Where are we at this time? Yeah, what the hell? Where do these guys go? Interesting. Okay. Quit clipping into my ass. Look at that up here. <laughs> oh, okay. No idea what he's doing. Out here in this forest? What the fuck? Who would ever think to do that? Oh, he found it. Okay. And a snowmobile keeps flipping. Oh! Oh, okay. Well, if it's not a secret, but nah, okay. Well, still cool, I guess. Well, damn, you're a lot better at finding secrets than I am. You only miss two on your first try, damn. That's impressive. stupid part. <laughs> Who thought this was a good idea? I'm gonna let him have a crack at it. Right now, but I can't piece it together. 
Okay, so basically from that base it's on the bottom... Okay. I'll have to remember that. This one I think is actually kind of easy. I at least remember this one. Yeah, I know about that one. I don't know about hardly any of the others, though. Okay, so there's like a little path that you can follow here. Interesting. Oh, this? Snowmobile, now is not a good time for you to start tipping over. I do know about this one too, there's like a rocket that you can find. right now. We have 6 out of 27. That's a lot. Okay, this way. Now the problem is trying to remember where all the shit is. Tip over and die, thanks. Okay.
nice. <laughs> most annoying one in my opinion. Well, while he tries to figure this out, I'm going to eat a little bit more. Yeah, true. Okay. This is kind of spooky. Okay, I know the one he's talking about. Did I find Oh yeah. I'm trying to remember where the last secret is exactly. I know it's on top of one of these hills. Yeah, there it is. You have to do like a little bit of platforming to get to it. 
And I think you have to jump, like, around here somewhere to get on top. Yeah, here you go. Basically, like, where he's going. Okay, so I do know about this one and the skill point, so basically I just need to remember, like, the other ones I didn't find. I'm replaying the game with co-op with some of my friends I made on Steam, so... There is still one slot open, and I think I made it a public game, so anyone who wants to can just hop on in. Still have one slot open for you. Meh meh. I love the little squeak toy sound effect, it's so nice. Black magic. Oh, so clear die. It just so happens that these guys are really fucking good at Serious Sam, so we have like this little, like, kind of elite squad thing going on, which is really hilarious. <laughs> We're just like blazing through the map with like times three enemies. Yeah, away with you. E. Okay. Whoops. Okay, there we go. Did, did you know that there's a classic skin for Sam? Uh, yes, actually. Uh, Reba here actually had it equipped a little while ago. Okay, it looks like they're taking care of the Witch Brides pretty good, so... Yeah, there we go. Headshot. Oh yeah, that's it. Cool. I actually don't know why he doesn't have it equipped anymore. It looked really cool. He just had it equipped for a short while, then unequipped it. Wonder if we get the get an achievement for being the game of co-op. Oh, nice. Well, I still hear some more. Or are they? Makam makam adahaha. Very nice. What does that mean? Hey, the creepy ghost. That was hauntingly beautiful. I fucking right, mate. What 
Did you see that flip? Oop! Okay. What was the worst and best one-liner of Siberian Mayhem? I actually just played it. I haven't really played it enough times to really memorize the one-liners. There's some pretty cringy ones, but I'd actually say overall the writing's better. Appa! More sniff. Yes, sniff. There we go. Ooh, that's a lot of snipers. Okay. We got an admirer. Very nice. Yeah, the OS. The, the soundtrack in this level is fantastic. I love it. J6000 has left the building. Okay, cool. Just random person showed up and then leaves. Okay, sure. Where did this man disappear to? Where are you? Oh.
Oh. Interesting. He meant that crossbow, not the one I'm holding. Incredible. The holy hand grenade. Gotta love those Monty Python references. They're just taking care of everything. I don't, I don't even know where they are anymore. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I think crossbow just kills everything. What is... Here. Oh, he's gonna take him out. Okay. Oh yeah, then the Trixa Shrine. I did find this one too. Yeah. Ooh, that's a lot of Mars. This kind of reminds me of that scene from the original Crisis where you're going through this kind of snowy field with a bunch of nanosuit soldiers backing you up. Wait, what? Oh. deserve to be a secret. That's just... No. Last hope easter egg. Where's that? Okay, I do know about this one too. Like the secret health that you grab and it spawns out a bunch of roller balls to try to kill you. There we go. Actually, he grabbed the super health. I did him. I'm just going to grab it really quick since I didn't really grab it before. Come to Papa. There we go. Oh, there's still roller balls. Okay, cool. Ah, uh, yes, the multi-rocket attachment. The most overpowered upgrade in the game. Come to me. Oh, 
Oh, I didn't even notice the road here. Yeah, I might break the sheet, the secret if you do that, who knows. There we go. a lot of drones. What do you mean, how do you open the bridge? you played this before. this before. Let me show you. You can actually just shoot it. I did not expect you could just do that. Okay. Secret gadget. Oh. Oh. This? Damn, you get a lot of these. I didn't even realize. Let's go, buddy. Oh yeah, this one. I remember this one. <clears throat> Did do this one.
I don't know why that clear decided not to attack me, but okay, I'll take it. Okay. That's fun. Okay, so life gadget. These towers are definitely easier to fight on foot, so... It seems to only be interested in me for some weird-ass reason. That was easy. I didn't even have to lift the finger, these guys just did everything for me. Yeah, I do know about this one. Yep. Fall into the thing. Okay, cool. I also know that there's a secret over here. Oh, shit, 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 shit. Okay. Yeah, there it is. There we go. Dealt with. Oh, he's oh okay. So I just need to get back to mine wherever it is. I think that's it. And this guy keeps leaving the game. Okay, whatever. Well, hopefully someone will join. Or I guess three players. I mean, three players is okay too. I'm actually having a lot more fun with this, doing it in co-op, than I did solo. Well, this map in particular, I would say, is better in co-op than solo.
Yep, okay. Did you find the cannon in this level? No, but I'm sure this guy will point me in the right direction because he's been finding everything. There's only seven secrets left. It actually doesn't seem that bad once you have someone that guides you who knows where they are. in already. How come I can't get in, but he can? What? You know what I don't have is... Oh, never mind. I don't have a vehicle anymore. Wait, right down here? Oh yeah. right there. I did not know that. I hate that secret. Those things take so much damage. But maybe with the cannon it's easier. Who knows. It's not that it's hard, it's just like a huge waste of ammo. In you go. To do, yeah.
<laughs> just ran over a seagull with a tractor. Very nice. So we have 24, this is 25. These things are tanky. Nice. <laughs> Very cool. Okay, so now we only have two secrets left. Cool. So basically I just need to, like, create, like, a strategy or something for remembering, like, where all these secrets are. Because I doubt I'm going to be able to remember all of them. Oh yeah, the this guy. I, I remember him. I did actually find that one, and then this should be the last, right? And this th this gadget. Oh damn! We actually did it.
news and I have bad news. The good news, we have found a nice present for you. Cool. What's the bad news? Ivan, it See you guys. Means. Please tell me those two things are unrelated. <laughs> yeah, I know about this one. Ah, well, sadly, Rusev has left us. That sucks. Wonder if he would be able to do, like, a sound port or something with the grenade launcher from this expansion pack back to Sirius M4. That'd be cool. Nice. Oh yeah, I did find this one too. Absolutely demolished. <laughs> you know what? I'm actually going to try the hoverboard here. This thing is so overpowered, <laughs> but in a cool way. Okay, so maybe a scooter isn't the best option for this. I think the airstrike probably would have been more useful. Well, I know that that ain't it. Oh, there's two of them. Cool. A tank? Good opportunity for puns. Then again, it's easy to go off track with those. Hell yeah, let's do this.
Oh, this thing's the best. I love it so much. This thing is just gorgeous. I can't stop gushing over it, it's just such a good idea. Oh, it's laggy though. Oh shit, that is laggy. I hope the server doesn't crash. Really hope the server doesn't crash. I have a feeling it might. Honestly, whoever at Timelock Studios did this, like, they, they deserve a, a promotion. For sure. Take his ass down. I think this is the most gorgeous thing I've ever seen. After the war, give me a call. Why is it knocking so far? Boys, has the serious Jeep just returned from the grave? <laughs> also, the gun's disabled for some weird reason. I can't use it anymore.
Move, move. Did, did it just, no, it didn't crash, okay. Wow, he actually got it in, what the fuck? I still wish co-op vehicles were a thing. Imagine if someone else could, like, just be the gunner on this, that would be so funny. Got a can. Wow. That's broken. <laughs> you could just move this thing in here. That's like Halo CE shit right here. This is the one I missed. Did it just crash? No. Oh, okay. Yeah. Since when did I say I like secrets? I'll tell you one never.
This thing's fucking hilarious. <laughs> I'm not a fan of this room. Let's see how it goes. Those Russian architects, man. They sure put things in weird places. Oh, do, 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 do. here it goes. Oh, it's so laggy. I think the game is about to just die on me. That's what it feels like. So laggy. Damn. Playing with you. Yeah, and I think the game's about to die anyway, so. Yeah, I think it's about time to end the stream, but. Damn, that was fun. If, I think if I wasn't streaming, it probably would have actually been a little bit more stable performance-wise, and also wouldn't have those weird kind of micro stutters. But I had a lot of fun. I don't know about you guys, but that was a cool little thing there. I enjoyed it. Well, I think that's it. I'll see y'all later. Thanks so much for tuning in. It's been really cool getting 400 subscribers and of course finally getting to beat Serious Am Siberian Mayhem. Now I guess all that's left is to go ahead and record myself playing through all the levels, do some videos, do a little bit of practicing, and yeah, we will have done